families in Coconino County still cleaning up after this week's monsoon storms pushed mud and water into their homes. Our Vinton Blandon has more now on the help being sent to the high country. Flash flooding making a mess in and out of homes in Coconino County. 30 men and women from the Arizona National Guard obeyed Governor Doug Ducey's order to head to Flagstaff. Most Major Kyle Key says were only 20 or so miles away doing annual training. We just pivoted those soldiers over there and then redirected them over here to the uh, Coconino Public Works right behind me. The major, a spokesman for the state's National Guard, shared pictures of the guardsmen working. They accomplished um, bagging about 5,000 bags and they put them on 65 pallets and then shrink wrapped them and then got them ready for transportation. The governor's office granted a request Saturday made by the county's emergency management agency on Friday asking for help bagging hundreds of thousands of sandbags. The city of Flagstaff warned Friday places in the museum fire burn scar area would see flash flooding. Joining the guardsmen in the high country on Sunday will be 30 more. Major Key expects the soldiers to stay until at least Friday. He's prepared to keep the detail in place longer if necessary. We have 600,000 sandbags to fill. And so it, you know, it, it's just a number. Uh, but it's going to be a challenge to get that done. I think we're up for the challenge. It'll be a lot of work, and uh, we're looking forward to, to doing it. The guardsmen working in Flagstaff are from all over the state, but some know the Flagstaff community quite well. There are some who are actually from this, this area, um, and the National Guard, that's what's the beauty about it, because we are part of the community in which we serve. Vincent Blandon, ABC 15, Arizona.